Hello, it's John Bauman. I hope you are having a good day. Here we're taking a look at the four different types of unemployment. And uh, let's take a look at all the choices here. The, we have cyclical, seasonal, structural, and frictional unemployment. In short, cyclical unemployment is because the economy is not doing well and the demand for a product has gone down. Seasonal unemployment is because somebody's working in one season and um, then uh, doesn't have a job in another season, is uh, looking for a job in the other season. Structural is because of uh, technology advances and uh, that uh, makes the person lose his or her job. Structural can also be because a company is moving to another country to do the, do the uh, manufacturing there. Frictional is when people are in between jobs, maybe are moving out of town or a spouse is moving out of town, or maybe you're done with your studies and you're temporarily looking for a job for a couple of months. The last category in this table here, it says not unemployed. Keep in mind that in order to be considered unemployed, you have to be not only out of a job, but you also have to be actively looking for a job. Now, if you look at the blue descriptions here, you can probably tell that they're all lined up incorrectly. So what you can do at this point is pause the video and see if you can figure out how to line up the descriptions correctly. So let me take off the descriptions and I'll push them to the side and then we'll rearrange all of them. And there we go. Now let's take a look at the first one. Laid off because his bank switched to online banking. Well that looks like that's because of technology so we're gonna put that into the structural box there. The second one laid off because of a slow economy and I'm gonna keep that right here and cyclical. This one here laid off because her spouse moved and she's temporarily looking for another job so that's a temporarily looking person because the spouse is moving. That's frictional. This one laid off because it's summer. He's a ski and it says he's not currently looking. So we got to push that one there. Not unemployed. Not looking. And the teacher. There's only one left. Teacher is on a nine-month contract. Let's say that teacher works through May or June. He's got three months off during the summer and happens to be looking during that time then that teacher is seasonally unemployed. Now if you're a teacher and you're not looking during the summer because you're happy with your your pay during the nine months then you would be not unemployed but this person is actually looking during the time that uh, he or she or in this case she is not uh, a teacher during the summer. 